Cheers, everybody. Back again with another beer review, like you do. This one, off to uh, Bladen in Newcastle. Uh, don't even ask me how to sing the Bladen races, because I haven't got a clue. Um, well, well, this was picked up, actually, from the brewery tap in Granger Market um, a couple of months ago. And it is a West Coast IPA from Firebrick Brewery. And it is a Canada Pacific. Clocking in at 6%. Super smashing great. There's the back side. I'll, I'll read you what it says. Um, it says, a, a refreshing splash of hoppy deliciousness. It says, USA West Coast IPA. Have we got the hops? No. Which is a bit of a bit of a no-no with me. I mean, American hops, put them on the can, won't you? Anyway, that's only a mild grumble, to be honest. It's nothing really because I've had I've reviewed beers from this lot before and I've enjoyed them, so they've been kind of like no nonsense, straight down to earth beer, and the the aroma straight away is a juicy. Slight tropical orange peachy aroma. It's got me uh, got me juices flowing in my mouth. You know. So let's pour it out like you do. Let's see what it's all about. Like you do. Hope everybody out there is enjoying their Good Friday. I don't know if this is gonna go up on Good Friday. I doubt it very much. But um happy Easter. <laughs> If you get this on the Wednesday or Thursday afterwards, happy Easter anyway. Um, so there we go. Beer in a glass. It looks pretty marmalady, West Coasty colour to me. Old school West Coast IPA colour. Sort of haziness there. Lots of carbonation. Um, one and a half, two finger heads. And there's a cat hair to boot as well. Like you do, so you get <laughs> it's one of my cats, not from Firebrick. Anyway, let's get the aroma in the Yeah, you get more of a biscuity, multi base feel in the aroma for me. Then you're getting lemon orange rind. It's there on top. It's a little bit of a cheesecake in aroma. That maltiness at the bottom with you know Bit of fruity notes on top, type of thing. So I'm going to go in. Cheers, everybody. Oh, God. I've got a punch up with the cats now. Come on. Go down. Good girl. Ah. We got a cat tower there, and <laughs> we got a cat tower there. It's, it's a, it nearly goes up to the ceiling. Okay, yeah, she's all right. She all right. <laughs> anyway, the cat tower, the, the cats are up there, and they kind of like fall down. This 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 review's going tits up. We really. Anyway, let's get back to the beer. It's rather decent. I like it. Um, like I say, it's not really, really bitter, this, for me. You're getting like a, it's kind of like a slickness in the mouth, in the mouth feel. It's like a oily slickness in a way, like, you know, hop oil type of slickness with like a marmalade, slight marmalade feel. you got your, your orange nectarines there lemons with a quite a multi base to it and it actually is really really good it is very enjoyable simple honest beer it is um so i have to say well i'll, I'll carry on look it's four only four minutes in only four minutes in look what you've done you've lost you absolutely fucked this one up you really have anyway Getting back to the beer, like you do. Um, it's actually a pretty solid beer, pretty decent. Um, 
on a spear again again. Very much, yeah, like a slickiness around the mouth with orange notes, lemon notes. And it's it's really, really good. It really is. I like it. And it's not too bitter either. I was expecting this to be more bitter. Um, but like I say, the only mild grumble is that they, they should put the hops on. That's me being a nerd. Um, that's just me. Anyway, boys and girls. Fabric Brewery and their Pacific. I like that. Cheap, you know, it's a good, honest little pint, that. Right. Got there in the end, didn't we? See you all in the next one. Cheers.